Just a short video here to show our cabin, Cackle Grackle, and show what it looks like pre addition and pre well and septic because the septic and the well will be going in in about one month. Today is March 5th, 2017, and this is it Cackle Grackle. Small cabin, uh, two bedrooms, and a living room, great room if you want to call it that, with a kitchen. And uh, we will have uh, two new bedrooms and a full bath when we're done and running water. The cabin is 25 feet long by 20 feet wide. And the two bedrooms are about 8 feet 9 inches by 7 feet wide. So two small little bedrooms, but um, we're going to have a real nice full-size kitchen when we're done. And uh, of course the two large bedrooms um, and one leading into the full bath. So this is the cabin from the front. And around the side. And this is where the addition will be going on. The addition will be about uh, 16 feet deep by 11 feet wide and that will house the two new bedrooms. Uh, we have the dog kennel here for the Britneys and of course the ubiquitous outhouse which we won't have too much use for that anymore. I don't know what we'll do with that going in the future maybe put in a little shooting range here. I don't know, we'll see. But this is the cabin and down around the back side. This is what we've got on the back side. And up underneath we have our building materials, some old building materials and tools for working outside, things like that. We've got plenty of dry, split dry kindling. My weak attempt at a garden, some tomatoes and some raspberries that never really took off, at least haven't taken off yet. And this is what it's like down below after we had it logged out. This should grow up and nice and thick, be good for wildlife in the future. And here's the other side. With my outdoor shower, which actually works really well with some heated water. And put it into a sprayer can, a shower sprayer. And it works great. So this is it, Cackle Grackle. And really looking forward to having the running water. It will be so nice to come up here, be able to have a hot shower, be able to do dishes, and uh, uh, have a toilet inside as well. Be able to do laundry when we come up here and just come up here and hang out and relax and not have to worry about carrying water or not being able to shower, uh, except for the outdoor shower. But it takes a lot of work to do that in the summertime. And it's not real practical to use at all in the winter. So, just really looking forward to having the running water, having these two real nice full size bedrooms attached here on this end right here. And uh, we'll be able to sleep, uh, we'll be able to sleep four very, very comfortably, and then probably up to six. More than six, it'll be a little bit crowded. A bunch of guys bumping into each other. But in bear season, we found that having um, three guys is kind of perfect. Four works out okay, but when we get more than four, it's really just too crowded inside this little structure. So having these new bedrooms will be a treat as well. Um, and uh, just 
I just can't wait for it. It'll be a great project. I'm also thinking of taking that brown siding, the uh, iconic brown cabin siding, and actually flipping that that white pine siding and the battens, flipping it over to the fresh side. Um, it'll be fresh wood. I like the fresh wood, the plain unstained wood look because the addition will also be done in, uh, in white pine uh, board and batten siding as well and uh, the whole thing will kind of match and it'll be trimmed out in brown. Um, plus we'll have another thing which is real big is we'll have windows that actually open. When this cabin was built it was built with static windows and um, these guys don't open so no ventilation uh, it's just really hard to get any ventilation it gets real stuffed up in there um, we've had mold spores starting to grow on some of our underneath the mattresses which we have to take time to clean that uh, clean that with bleach and so forth to keep everything clean we've done a real good job of keeping this place clean and nice um, since we've owned it uh, we bought it in October of 2010 my wife and I and our family has enjoyed a lot of really good times up here uh, plus our traditional uh, bear camp our turkey spring gobbler camp uh, trout season um, we've done some bow hunting up here we have uh, never hunted deer up here yet except for a few bow hunting trips and uh, hiking trips we have uh, so we've had some great times coming up here to go hiking in the summer, uh, hiking some of the trails up here in the state forest in Pennsylvania. So again, just a real quick video to show Cackle Grackle, show what it looks like um, post uh, pre-construction. Great little place. Can't wait. Thanks.